Hey guys, welcome back to another video and if you're new here today, my name's Stuart. Thanks for joining me. Now in today's video, I want to help you choose the best website builder for your business and discuss the differences between WordPress and some of the most powerful website builders on the market today. Now we put this video together for complete beginners looking for an easy and inexpensive way to build a website and launch it online. Now, just quickly before we get started, and if you're new to this channel, consider subscribing to stay updated with practical videos and tutorials designed to equip you with the skills and knowledge to help grow your small business online. And with that covered, let's jump into today's video. WordPress is not exactly a website builder. It's actually part of the family called CMS, Content Management System. Essentially, you still have to learn a few basics before getting started with WordPress to build your website. However, fortunately, over the years and due to the rise in popularity of easy to use website builders like Wix, Squarespace, Shopify, Webly and others, you now have access to many themes and plugins that help complete beginners build powerful websites with complete ease with WordPress. For example, one of our favorite WordPress themes is called Divi. The reason we love this theme is we can build an amazing website for our clients and then show them how to simply use the Divi theme on their WordPress website to make simple changes, add content, and even make new pages on their website. Rather than having to pay web developers for these changes, business owners can save a lot of money and make these changes themselves. Using WordPress and a simple to use theme like Divi allows beginners to build an amazing website from scratch or from powerful pre-made templates that are available through the Divi theme. However, you will need to watch and follow a tutorial or two to get the hang of using WordPress and the Divi theme. Now, it's a fact that WordPress will take longer for complete beginners to get the hang of making the most out of WordPress and actually building a website compared to using website builders. However, you have more options in terms of website functionality and customizations through WordPress. Also, if you decide to move your WordPress website to another hosting provider, you can do so. However, with a website builder, you cannot. And therefore, if you want to move to another host or website builder, you will have to build your website from scratch. Now, the one main advantage of using a website builder over a CMS like WordPress is the ease of use. For example, most website builders have a visual builder, drag and drop builder, allowing you to simply drag and drop elements in the form of features, images, text and more. It's very easy to quickly build a website and launch it online in minutes after signing up to a website builder. Okay, so now I want to list the advantages of using each of the website building options we've just discussed, so you have a better idea of what option is better for your website requirements. So firstly, we have WordPress. Now, WordPress offers unlimited customizations, unlimited features, thousands of themes and plugins, more integrations than website builders, and you're able to move to another hosting provider if you choose to do so. Okay, so now on the other hand, the advantages of going with a website builder as opposed to a CMS like WordPress is that you have access to a simple drag and drop website building experience. And website builders are ideal for complete beginners with absolutely zero experience. Everything is also in one place and you can launch your website in minutes. With a website builder, you also have easy management and hosting, and no design talent is required when building a website with a website builder. Okay, so now that we've covered the advantages of each of the website building options, what would be the best option for you? Well, if you have a little bit of experience with websites or even open to learning more, I suggest giving WordPress a go and using the Divi theme for creating highly functional and stunning websites. However, if you're a complete beginner and you just want to quickly build and launch your new website online, then there are many website builders to choose from. Our top options are Wix, 
Squarespace and Shopify. Wix and Squarespace are great options for small businesses like restaurants, consultancies, uh, cafes and accommodation businesses as well as other service based businesses. Wix has more features and integrations however Squarespace is more elegant and professional looking. Now if you plan on selling products online then we would recommend checking out Shopify as this is the best option for complete beginners looking to launch an e-commerce store. You can find the links to all these website building options in the description below this video and just remember they are affiliated so if you click on them, if you buy through them, then we get paid a small commission and that just helps us continue producing high quality content for this channel so thank you in advance. Now with that said, I suggest giving all the options we've just gone through a test run with the free trials that they offer and just see what website building option works best for you and your website requirements. And that is all for today's video. I hope this helped you identify what option is going to work best for your website requirements. Now, if you have any questions about this video, make sure to pop them down below. And with that said, thank you so much for watching this video all the way through to the end. If you got value from this video, you enjoyed it, then please leave a like below the video. And if you haven't done so already, make sure to subscribe. And that way, I will see you in the next video. Take care, guys.